All right, so it's day two of Iceland vlog, our Iceland trip. Antonio is in the shower, he's getting ready, the day's about to start. I just decided to come outside and uh, and give you guys a little bit of a quick rundown of yesterday, which was an amazing day. We flew into town, as you guys saw, and did some sightseeing. We came to this cabin in a remote area, absolutely beautiful. Finished the night in the hot tub, having some drinks, having some laughs. Went to bed and now a new day begins. And um, no better way to start the day but with a scenery like this. I'll show you guys in a minute. It's absolutely gorgeous. Uh, it rained a little bit this morning, but now the sun is out and it just looks beautiful. It, it's a stunning, 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 stunning view. I can't, I, I can't get over that. I'm not quite sure what the day is going to bring. I think we're going to go either to the Blue Lagoon, the Hidden Lagoon, the the no man land lagoon i don't know why there's seems to be like all sorts of different lagoons so we're going to go somewhere like that then i think we're going to drive into the city check out the place where we're staying for the next couple of days and um and just hang out pretty much uh, because the next two days are going to be super busy uh with obviously vodka metal battle on saturday and some sightseeing and all of that stuff but i couldn't ask for a better trip so far and i could definitely not ask for uh, a better view this looks gorgeous so let me show you guys how this view looks like okay isn't this incredible so this is outside the um, outside the the cabin and that's how it looks like show you guys around the corner here All right, so uh, yeah, I mean, that's pretty much self-explanatory. It says exactly what uh, what this place looks like and what it's all about. It's absolutely beautiful and gorgeous, and uh, just come along for the ride. I'm going to grab some breakfast. I'm a little hungry. I just got up, so let's see what the day brings. All right, guys? All right, some riveting stuff. Me having a sandwich. Breakfast of the champions. All right, so that's Oliver over there, and he's going to try to not kill himself. Just go. Achievement unlocked. All right, he survived. <laughs> he made it, he made it. Okay, now we have to talk to the superstar here and find out first-hand take on how it was. It was awesome, guys. Everyone has to try it at least once, but that's enough. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
Look at that, that's the steam coming out. gonna go for it anyways we don't care we're not made out of sugar unless you're sugar tits maybe we'll sacrifice somebody and throw them in there i was thinking maybe we should sacrifice somebody and throw them in there not with you <laughs> like rotten eggs it stinks here it absolutely stinks here but it is what it is tradition for baking bread in the geothermal area. The hole is dug in the sand until boiling water is reached and a pot of dough is put in the sand. The bread is baked in the geothermal and is over a period of 24 hours. The bread is often served as a char or a loaded Oh, yeah, cold, stinky. This is the geyser. We're gonna go check it out. Hopefully nobody dies and hopefully I don't get dirty because it looks muddy as fuck. And uh, yeah, it looks like Middle Earth. Some Lord of the Rings. One ring, I don't know, whatever it says. One ring for what? For one, one, one ring per cock? One ring per cock. Will it unite us all? Oh wait, that's, that's Harry Potter, the one that makes you invisible. Oh, there's a cock ring on Harry Potter oh, that makes you visible. Cape. Oh my God, it would make you. It's a cape. Is is <laughs> isn't that a cock ring? <laughs> All right. And then I would just you know dump you know a few boxes in, into into the into the geyser, and that would uh, induce some some chemical reaction to. It's really good really high. It's more than last time. It was a big one. It's cold. It's cold. It's cold. I mean this part here. Looks like a <laughs> <laughs> This is the Niagara Falls of Iceland. And now we're gonna go down this tiny little path all the way there, and that's where they sacrificed the virgins. No, that's not where they sacrificed the virgins. But that's the story that I'm going with, and since I'm the one recording, I can pretty much say whatever the hell I wanna say. 
So that's what's going to happen. Look at that. It is very impressive. Alright. So we walked all the way from the top over there, all the way down this tiny little ridge, all the way here, so we could see this force of nature. And if you look closely, you can find the spot where the last virgin was killed. Just kidding. Boobs. All right, let's go up top there and see it from a different angle. Don't go close. You're clumsy as fuck. Antonio, what do you think of the Icelandic uh, Niagara Falls? It's okay. where we're going to be staying for the next couple of days while we're in uh, Reykjavik. Uh, I, I think you guys got a pretty good idea of how the day went with the exception of the secret lagoon, but it's a fucking secret. Yeah. So we couldn't really film it or let you guys know where it is. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a, a secret, secret lagoon anymore. Plus, who wants to see the two of us shirtless and flabby walking into a hot pool? A very long, hot pool. extended hot pool with other people that also are flabby and whatever. Like, no, nobody wants to see that shit. So, I didn't film anything there, but I just want to let you guys know that we had a great time. Well, he didn't film anything for YouTube. The OnlyFans is still there. Yes, the content was only, only, only fans. But yeah. anyways, we had a great time there. The whole day has been absolutely, like, outstanding. Actually, our whole stay so far, uh, this is the end of day two, has been absolutely phenomenal. So, huge thanks to our hosts for not only inviting us, but taking us around with everybody else and showing us the great scenery and the, the great outdoors of, of Iceland. It's been absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal, it's been phenomenal. Amazing. Yeah, uh, but let's just, a quick recap for today. What was one of your highlights? Well, I like... Or actually for the last two days, because we didn't do this yesterday. So yeah, for we the didn't last do this days. yesterday. Obviously, going to the cabin was really nice. The scenery in the cabin, um, you know, the, the hot tub with the boys. Oh, yeah, yeah, we, we hot tubbed it at the end of uh, night one. Yeah. That, that also did not make the tapes, because once again, that's only fans... Material. Kind of con content, yes. There was uh, a lot of skin on skin on that night. Uh, just, I mean, driving around in general is an adventure in itself. Because the scenery is out of this world. Ex yeah. I agree. I mean, you'll never see anything like it in most other countries, especially in Canada. Yeah, and, and today with the geysers, I had never seen a real life geyser yeah. in person. Like we just to see like three, four different... Ex um, yeah, there was that dual explosion, and yeah, there was those yeah. big explosions. The, the, um, the hot springs uh, pool was just... Out of this world. And the cows. Yeah, everything. E everything. The ice cream. Uh, everything was fucking phenomenal. We had a great day. And the day is great, but the company also helps make the day even greater. So yeah. shout out to everybody who's been part of this uh, Vakken Metal Battle Iceland. All the judges. Everybody's been absolutely gracious. Our hosts. And tomorrow is day three. And day three comes with the actual battle itself. But it's going to be a busy day. Because there might be some penises in tomorrow's video. There might. Maybe. Potential. You have to check it out. 
and then obviously there's the actual battle and that's going to be off the hook it's going to be absolutely amazing uh and more adventures to come yeah on the days ahead so thank you for watching yesterday's vlog thank you for watching today's vlog and keep looking out for day three which once again is going to include the actual battle itself so you're going to be able to check out the bands the venue everything and uh we'll see you guys on the next vlog see ya see ya